I think Who's the Boss was very successful because of the disparate characters that made the triangle in it. Because you had a, a, a fella kind of from the streets who had a daughter to look after and wanted a better life for her. And he was a, an immaculate man who was used to a, a clean house. And the thing that he knew how to do was clean a house, and he had all, already had other kinds of many jobs, but by bringing his daughter to the suburbs and into a nice home with another child in the home, he was able to give her a better life to grow up in, and he was willing to let go of his life for his child. And that was interesting to see from a man that came kind of from a tough neighborhood. and. Then, then you had a, a, a young woman who had no husband but a child and was very successful in business and very driven and very much a woman of today and yet was missing the kind of human part of her life. And then you had the mother that was in the middle of them who hadn't experienced anything in life but decided to leap in and, and just do and find a life that was wonderful. And I think you had disparate characters that came from three backgrounds who learned to live together and learned to have a sense of humor about themselves. And by pooling all their resources and their humor and their dedication to each other, they all grew as people and made a better life for each other. And I think that that just appealed to the general public to see how all these three people came from a different situation and yet made a life together that worked.